I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a tree for Arbor Day. I come right up at the very top at the center and I put a dot and from that dot I'm going to draw a wavy 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 line around up and connect. I come in the center and I draw one straight line down one straight diagonal up. I come back to the center I draw one straight line down one straight diagonal up and I leave it floating. I come back to the left and right about here I'm just going to start drawing a wavy 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 line up connect. I come on the right hand side and I start drawing a wavy 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 line up connect. I come back to the left and I'm going to draw a slightly curved line down straight line and leave it floating. I come to the right and I'm going to draw a slightly curved line down and leave it floating. I come back over here on the left and I'm just going to draw a big curved line off the page. And I'm going to come back in and I'm going to draw another big curved line down off the page. And right here I'm going to draw another big curved line down off the page. Now I come back up to the left and I continue this line, connect on the left, continue this line, connect on the right. I come up to the top on the left here and I just draw a wavy, wavy, wavy line. Bam! It crashes into that, jump over, wavy, wavy line, connect. I come on the right hand side and I draw another wavy, wavy, wavy line, connect jump over, wavy wavy line, connect. I come back over here on the left and I draw a wavy wavy line, connect, jump over, wavy wavy line, connect. On the left, I come on the right hand side, wavy 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 line, connect, jump over, wavy wavy line, connect inside this space I just draw a straight line curve line straight line down straight line curve line and leave them floating up at the top I'm going to write Arbor Day and Arbor Day is the day that we celebrate the planting upkeep and preservation of trees so right here I'm going to start a repeating curve line up, back, connect. 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 And if you've got room, curve line up, back, connect. Now I come down here and I draw two straight lines, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. Two straight lines, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. Two straight lines, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. Two straight lines, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. Two straight lines, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. Two straight lines, curve line, curve line, connect. Two straight lines, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. Two straight lines, curve line, curve line, connect. Two straight lines, curve line, curve line, connect. I come through this space and I'm just going to draw straight diagonal lines all the way down and across and right here I'm going to put one two dots. 
I come up to this space in here and I just go curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, down here, curve line, curve line. Okay, let's see how we are going to color this in. Okay, probably one of the most important things we have to remember is that trees improve the air quality. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to double color. I'm going to take my yellow green and I'm just going to make some curve line, curve line color lines on the inside of each one of these spaces. Doesn't have to be exact, but I just want that extra color. Now if you've got a big crayon box that has a lot of different colors of green, you can go ahead and do that also. But I just have yellow green and green green. So I'm going to go ahead and use a double color technique. So first I do my yellow green. Then I'm going to come by and I'm going to do the same thing but with my regular green. I'm just going to add some curved lines in each one of my spaces, working my way down. And I'm going to color dark green or green green my little popcorn trees down here at the bottom. Color these all in. And then what I'm going to also do, <clears throat> excuse me, is take my green and right next to my yellow green on my leaf pattern, I'm going to add another color of green. Now that I've done this, I come back in and I lightly loop-de-loop -loop with my regular green each one of these spaces. Now like I said, if you've got a big deluxe crayon box, you might have all kinds of different greens. Sea foam, Saladon, those are all colors of green. Go ahead and use them. Go ahead and use them. Now, this always happens. Once I start coloring, look, I forgot, whoops, that part right there. Just take your greens and color it in. All better. I come down and I do my leaves. This is a repeating pattern down here at the bottom. And they started Arbor Day in 1872. In Nebraska, more than one million trees were planted that day. So I'm going to take my brown and do these little tree trunk spaces, brown. And I'm going to color in this space. So they planted a million trees back in 1872. I'm sure that we can do that. We've got an organization called the Tree People that plant trees throughout the communities. They say trees are the lungs for the earth because they supply oxygen. Okay, so that's all of those. I look down here, I see some little white spaces, so I'm going to fill those in with green. Now, I take my yellow and I color in this space right here yellow. And I really feel, we just got done with Earth Day, but it's almost like I feel like Arbor Day should have just as much importance because it really hits home to our communities. A tree-lined street is a beautiful thing. So there's my yellow. Now I take my blue-green and I'm going to color in this space. This could almost be my little community trees. I'm doing a loop-de-loop, -loop, not too dark, but I'm coloring it in. And now I take my blue-green and add my background. 
you might want to check your community. There could be a tree planting, tree people group in your community and see if they have something going on on Arbor Day. All right, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here is my drawing for Arbor Day. Remember, it celebrates nature and to plant more trees in our communities. Okay, bye-bye.